Hi, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 22nd, 23rd, 24th, 25th, something like that. What do we have for a message today? The sun reversed, so the sun reversed and no answer, not happy, maybe burnt out, maybe in a dark energy, this could be in the shadow, right, need to work on your shadow, your darkness, maybe it's a lack of clarity, maybe it's not even seeing, I mean the opposite of light is dark, in the dark. could be dealing with a Leo, doesn't have to be, but this is sad, maybe depressed, maybe there's a lack of vision, not seeing something clearly, poor logic, Hmm. Ten of Pentacles. Ooh. And the Ace of Pentacles reversed. Very interesting. The Ten of Pentacles is long term security, it's flourishing uh, success. It's having plenty. The Ace of Pentacles reverse an unplanned loss in all reality. This is a no answer as well. You know, somebody may be, may be letting something go or something slipping away. Maybe it's unreal. The sun card reversed is false impressions due to disillusionment. It's all that toxic positivity, right? You have to, the darkness, you have to focus, you have to see the darkness, yeah, darkness, yeah, you have to acknowledge the darkness to heal from it, to change it. Oh, I guess he can be positive, it's all gonna be positive, it's all positive, it ain't fucking positive. I mean, there's war everywhere. Everywhere. Getting home from your trip, even to the grocery store, is a blessing. Let's all just think positive and pretend that nothing is happening. It's all amazing. Tomorrow's going to be amazing. The next day is going to be amazing. The next day is going to be amazing. The next month is going to be amazing. You have miracles coming in. It's a miracle to be alive, yes. But what is real?
You're gonna live in La La Land? Anyhow, Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles is long-term security. It's having it all. It's flourishing success. Maybe on your own. Let's subtract one from the ten. What do we get? The Nine of Pentacles. This is about you taking soul action. Being grateful for what you have. Putting in the work. To yourself. Focus on what you're doing to aid in the darkness or the light. Who are you complaining with on Facebook or Instagram? Who are you arguing with? Who are you laughing at? Who are you egging on to fight? Who are you supporting? What are you disillusioned by? The false positivity? Ace of Pentacles reverse. No, this isn't solid. This isn't stable. It's not secure, but boy, it sure does appear to be, doesn't it? Some flippers. There they are. Quite a few. Four of Pentacles reverse. At least I shuffle on camera so you can see the truth. But so many people want to live in the disillusionment because it sounds real good. I'm just talking about these readings I'm talking about in real life. Looks good. Sounds good. Seven of Wands reversed. Judgment. <laughs> Five of Swords reversed. Wow, look at the reversal. She did that on purpose. You saw me shuffle. You saw me flip. I want to hear the reversals. Why not? Why don't you want to see reversals? Why don't you do reversals? Because hmm? it doesn't paint the picture that you want to hear? The moon. This is a distorted view, and it's upright. It's covered by the shadow. What you see is not what you get. The star, upright. Hmm. There's healing. Unexpected help arriving. I'm going to have to edit that. Six of Wands. Victory. Victory after sorrow. Congratulations. No. This is a poor judgment call. No. 
It's not the truth. It's time to move on from that poor choice. It's time to accept. It's time to release. There's poor judgment here. There's somebody here that only cares about themselves. This person is very selfish, very egotistical, doesn't care who they hurt. They're only doing something just for the money. All they care about is the money. Actually, they're very insecure. They're spiteful. They're revengeful. They're hateful. They're nasty. This is somebody that is trapped in their head. They're full of mental turmoil. It's like they're doing something. I don't know if they're doing slander. They're, there's foul flat play. Trying to take somebody out of their position. Fighting. There's lack of awakening here. We have somebody here that is in a dark, dark place. Okay. They're, they're, they need... They're not answering the higher call. There's a need to wake up. Refusing to accept the truth. Refusing. Oh my God, I am so sick of this broken record. It's sad. It is. Sun wouldn't be reversed either otherwise. Judgment reversed. Making a poor judgment call. Misjudging. Not seeing, not awakened, lack of clarity. There's ego here. Well, that's the main culprit now, isn't it? And fear, fear and self doubt. Because we got somebody here who doesn't believe in themselves. Remember that Ten of Pentacles? That Ten of Pentacles goes back to, minus the One, goes back to the Nine of Pentacles. We do have a release. We have a release here. We have an opening up. We have somebody, in it, but I feel like there's been some sort of delay because of not willing, not willing to see, not willing to wake up and staying in a dark situation. Poor logic, unhealthy thinking. And there is a such thing as toxic positivity. Please look it up. You're seeing it 90% of the time. You have to acknowledge the darkness. Seven of Wands reverse. Seven of Wands reverse is quitting, stepping down, giving up, sh losing a position. We have somebody here that may be burnt out, breaking free from something they have been trapped in. It is definitely a mindset that I have to fight. I gotta fight. I gotta fight, 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 fight. Oh, jeez. Not very spiritual. Made a poor judgment call, and that's it right there. As we all make poor judgment calls, I made one the other day. No. This is not very wise. Somebody could be doing something that's not very wise. It could cost them. It's like they want to fight. They want to defend. It's like they want to fight. It's, and it's because of the, something that is going on in their head. You know, it's in their head. Something is going on in their head. Somebody's being critical. They're being too critical or, or they're not being critical enough. There's something about criticism here. Removing an obstacle, finding a solution, probably means stepping down or walking away or being taken down. Something could be taken down. Somebody's made a poor judgment call. They've made a decision. They've done something. It was not thought out. It was poor logic. It was... And maybe it was done out of spite, you know, or, or out of, well, darkness. 
The star card, I had to turn it over because of the picture. So if you saw the cards go away down at the bottom of the screen, you know, I gotta follow the rules, right? All is not as it seems. There's a distorted vision. There's something that you're not seeing. There is, it's a time of hope and wish fulfillment and dreams coming true, but there will be a shift. There will be a change. You'll have to change your position. You may have to stop trying to prove something or fight for something or something like that. Let go of your insecurities. There's something about insecurities here. If you go back to the Nine of Pentacles, that is about security. So there's something happening. You may not see it. You may not, you may not realize. You may not realize why there's something happening. There could be a loss. Okay, maybe it's a loss of money or a loss, you know, due to fighting or, or something like that. It can be... Somebody that is choosing to give up on something, that would be the wisest decision as far as I'm concerned. You also need to be careful here. There is somebody here that needs to be careful because there's an individual that is making a poor judgment call based on their own... Uh, maybe wanting to blame somebody for something... You know, point the finger at somebody else right here. It's like they want, they want, don't want to be held accountable. They're in a dark, depressed state of mind. You know, they're they're having some sort of mental turmoil right now, so they may be trying to blame somebody. I feel like we have somebody here that maybe they were fighting over money or doing something over money, and the answer was no. There's some sort of battling uh, has to do with money or uh, position. I feel like there's a door opening though. There's an opportunity here to have a peaceful resolution. So there could be a peaceful resolution, but somebody has to, they may have to change their position or give up their position or stop fighting. Something about a battle coming to an end because of the Six of Wands over here. So we do have a battle that is ending, you know, the war, whatever this battle is. And it's funny that I started this out with war everywhere. It's about how are you contributing? How are you letting your darkness contribute to the wars? And I'm not just talking about, you know, in the Middle East or the Ukraine. I'm talking about on the streets. I'm talking about everywhere. I'm talking about online. What is your contribution? I know a lot of people don't care, right? I got something to prove because my self-esteem is so low. It's all like all those little laughing at things that people go on the people that they don't support and they laugh and it's just like, you realize that everybody can see your character? No, they don't. No, they don't realize it. There's some sort of release. Now, it's kind of like that hostage situation where someone gets released, you know? So, I don't know. It's in, in, the, in whatever, and you got to look at it as a metaphor. Breaking free from a situation that has hindered your growth, your spirituality. It's all part of the lesson, though, right? Around the, we had the Wish Fulfillment card, I believe, right in the same position, different deck. Not yesterday, because I took yesterday out the day before. Anyhow, um, but we have it again. So this is a time of hope, inspiration, inspiration, unexpected help, healing, a blessing. After an event, after the tower falls, after some sort of major disruption, unexpected, something about humanity as well. Somebody's been wanting to win, wanting to prove something, wanting to fight. But I do believe that there's something coming up that you don't see, okay? You may not see this. There's something below the surface. There's something that you're not seeing. 
The Six of Wands is a hero, it's a veteran, it's a soldier, it's somebody that leads others out of danger. This is a leader, not into danger, out of danger. This is like the chief, right? The commander, the leader. Leaders guide people away from the battle. This is some sort of resolution. Maybe some sort of peaceful resolution. Could be a fight though. I mean, I mean, if somebody's made a poor judgment call due to disillusionment, they need to let go. Something about the money or the security or the stability, let it go. Let something go. Stop fighting. Walk away. You know, to have a peaceful resolution. Maybe admit defeat. Somebody may be admitting defeat. They may be stepping down or they're losing their position. Um... There's lies here. There's some sort of lies. Somebody could also be getting caught. Okay? Somebody could be getting caught. They may not. It's, a, it's almost like doing something in the dark. And they think that they're not going to get caught. And they get caught. So somebody's about to get caught. This is somebody that is very, very cocky. It's kind of like behind the screen, right? There's been some sort of restrictions here. They're self-imposed. Or there's been a situation that somebody has been trapped in, but I feel like there's freedom. I feel like there's some sort of freedom from that by admitting defeat or walking away or stepping down from the position. There could be a fight. There could be a stiff competition here, okay? Just saying. We have somebody here that is in mental duress or distress. That's what it is. It's distress. Definitely. There could even be some paranoia here going on, you know, where somebody is really struggling. They're in, in a deep state of fear. What? Fear of what? Fear of truth coming out. Fear of losing something. Fear of losing something that they had. Now, the star is a card of renewal, purpose, reason. Every, you know, and, and I know people don't want to hear it. Everything happens for a reason. And it's, you may not know why. I feel like there is a difficult path ahead. But there's an opportunity for wish fulfillment here. But you have to face your fears. You have to be honest with yourself. You have to uh, not engage with the hate, the, the ego, the battling. Okay? It's like, it's about healing. I mean, a lot of people just don't want it. They're in such a dark state of mind that they do not want to heal. Or they don't want to wake up. This is very interesting that this is coming out. We do have somebody here that is doing something malicious. Extremely malicious. And I think it's because they were told no. There's something that you are not seeing for sure. We have a very egotistical individual here that I don't know if this person is doing something, you know. Um, they've been unwilling to negotiate, okay. They've been wanting to win, wanting to prove something. But I feel like there is some sort of negotiation available or something like that. No, it's time to let go. It's time to release. It's time to let go of your insecurities. Stop 
fighting. <laughs> It's time to move on from that poor choice. There's an unclear and difficult path ahead, but there's a need to look deeper, look deeper, look deeper. That's the moon. But the Six of Wands is the end of some sort of tense battle. Getting some sort of recognition, you know, congratulations. Okay, so, so there could be some sort of definitely public recognition here. You know, the star can represent fame as well. The Six of Wands can as well, because this is a leader. This is like a parade, right? This, this guy is walking through a parade. He's, he's being uh, congratulated, looked up to. There's definitely somebody here that is looked up to. This is somebody that, that is not interested in fighting or playing games anymore. They're all done. The battle is over. The war is over. The, the situation is done. This person may be leaving behind some sort of illusion, some sort of fantasy, you know. That, you know, whatever it is. There is going to be some movement. There is. Some, there's, been a, there's been a lot of darkness. There's, it's, this has been really, really sad. But it's because of a poor judgment call. And there's been some sort of lies and wanting to win, wanting to prove, wanting to prove, wanting to prove. There's some sort of obstacle that is being removed. You may not see it. Okay, there's something you definitely don't see. There is an obstacle that is being removed that has been causing a lot of challenges. It's been causing a lot of opposition. It's been hard to deal with. It's been draining. It's been... Uh, dark it's a dark energy it's a low vibrational situation okay it's unhealthy but that star card is a card of hope and renewal and uh, a wish being granted it's unexpected help it's guaranteed success to have success you may have to face your fears or you may have to be patient. Even though you don't know the outcome, believe, have faith. There's a need to have faith. There's a need to have faith. But the star is a card of faith and believing. We got somebody here that didn't see something. They were very focused on money. Money, 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 money. <laughs> Just like that, too. It is the root of all evil. It really is. There is some recognition that is coming. We are about to see some progress. You may not understand it or see what's happening because of the, the, if you just focus on the positivity, you'll never really see what's going on. Now people are so unwilling. I'm gonna live in La La Land. Do you really want to prove yourself? Or do you want peace? That is the question. That is the question. Do you want peace today? Tomorrow? Next week? 
next year starts with you and me. <laughs> no, I just want to fight. I just want to fight. Right? How many of you said that? That's sad. There's consequences. There's karma. There's loss for fighting. For being selfish. Somebody is getting some sort of recognition for uh, because they're done. This is this the, the fighting. There's some sort of battle that is ending. This is congratulations. It's it's victory after sorrow. You know, there's a there's something coming that you don't see that is going to bring some sort of wish fulfillment. Somebody's been trapped in a situation maintaining their position because they, they've been trapped in a situation mostly because of their mentality. But I do see freedom here. There could be a fight as well. There definitely could be a fight here. Some sort of truth could be coming out. Lies could be being exposed. Crime could be being exposed. Um, things are being exposed. And you may not understand why they're being exposed, but... And they're being exposed so that we can have success. There is some progress, believe, believe it or not. Good luck.